Hi guys, so I'm here to talk to you guys about the sustainability transition and for me, the sustainable transition for me, my goal is to have a uh, cleaner water supply of the Colorado River and with the cleaner water, we have a healthier ecosystem for the wildlife where they can have unpolluted water, where they can survive and there's oxygen for the fishes and uh, that's for that stuff and uh, for human well-being with cleaner water we have cleaner water for us to use so um, it's for us human we are made of like over 90% of water so we need the clean water obviously and for the viable uh, economies my go um, how that tied with the um, my goal was uh, with cleaner water we have more opportunity to uh, use the water for recreational purposes and uh, uh, there's ways to make money off of that I'm pretty sure with cleaner water people aren't afraid of the Colorado River to get in there and like have some fun and for the multiple phase concept uh, which is pre-development takeoff acceleration and stabilization for the pre-PD version uh, my goal for that is to uh, come up with laws, restriction, do some legal work over the Colorado River because I know a portion of our legal um, stresses is going to be on Mexico because they do own a portion of the Colorado, Colorado River. And for the takeoff, uh, I'm just going to basically enforce the uh, rules, the restriction, um, and uh, if uh, finding out someone's uh, taking advantage of the rules, we're going to have some harsh punishment for them. And for the acceleration, my goals for that is just let the legal system work out its way where people are afraid of us more than like uh, uh, of the rules, I guess, because of the harsh punishment. And it's slowly going to just encourage people not to take advantage of the water supply. And uh, for stabilization, uh, I'm just gonna make it really hard for new uh, business to uh, come in, get use of the water supply. And yeah, I think that's uh, all I have for you guys and thank you for your time.